Hundreds of climate change activists demonstrated outside the Brazilian embassy in Paris, urging action on the wildfires ravaging the Amazon as international criticism mounts. And the leader of France adds his voice to a chorus of concern. The Brazilian rainforest has been burning like never before, disseminating every corner of the world's largest tropical forest, seen as vital to countering global warming. The unfolding crisis has since turned political. On Twitter, French President Emmanuel Macron called the plight of the Amazon an international crisis that should be on the agenda at this weekend's G7 summit in France. Our house is burning, literally. The Amazon rainforest, the lungs of our planet, which produces 20% of our oxygen, is on fire, Macron wrote. The tweet angered Brazil's pro-business president Jair Bolsonaro, whose anti-environmental policies have been blamed for allowing farmers and ranchers to exploit the Amazon. Bolsonaro accused Macron of using the fires for political gain and blasted his French counterpart as sensationalist. Bolsonaro also tweeted, the French president's suggestion that Amazonian issues be discussed at the G7 without the participation of the countries of the region evokes a misplaced colonialist mindset in the 21st century. The country's Space Research Center says the number of fires in Brazil is more than 80 percent higher than last year. More than half are in the Amazon region, threatening to bring potentially catastrophic consequences to the planet. Prime Minister Justin Trudeau, who landed in France for the G7 earlier today, will join Macron in calling for an emergency discussion about the fires and a renewed focus on protecting nature. Environmental groups are urging the G7 countries not to use the Amazon fires to distract from their own failures to cut emissions. A report card released by the Climate Action Network ahead of the G7 summit said that the world's wealthiest nations, including Canada, are lagging, not leading, in the fight to reduce climate change at home.